What's up everyone, this is Cybernaut, and today I thought it'd be cool to show you guys uh, part of my brand new setup that I have here today. This is the uh, FlexBot uh, Canna Pro Bamboo Standing Desk. So yeah, this is actually a company that partnered up with me, and they sent me this desk to do uh, like a video on it, and also I thought it'd be perfect for my new setup, because uh, with this I wanted a table that would be really big, so then I could use this for live streaming and, and uh, recording and everything too. You could also use this like for your computer setup as well because it is actually a standing desk. I'll show you that here in a second. But you can stand up at this and it's motorized so I actually move up and down. But I thought it'd be good for unboxing videos and things like that because again you have to get a variety of different angles of, for your shots and everything on that. So I figured this would help me out quite a bit. And I wanted to have a little bit more open space which... By the way, in my setup right now, you are actually seeing about as far back as I can show you on this table because this is a huge table. My room is barely big enough because I was like, hey, just send me the biggest one you have and they did. <laughs> they really did. But yeah, this is amazing looking. Of course, I have a link down in the description to this website so you can check out the different tables that they have. Even has controls over here as you guys can see. You can, of course, go up with this. You can go down. It's kind of hard to show like this, but I'm going to use both cameras to try to show it to you guys. And then you can even set it like with all these different presettings. So I think number one is that that one goes pretty high. I don't know if that's the standing. I just set all this up. So I'm trying to see. I feel like I'm shrinking. <laughs> so yeah, there you go. There's actually the standing desk for you. I'd have to move the camera up and everything, but there you go. I think I had this one for sitting. Yeah, number two on it that I mashed. That actually gets you for the sitting position right there. It's still a little bit high for the other camera. But you guys can see. You see the number go down and everything. And you can program this all really easily too. You also have the standing and sitting. I haven't programmed these two. And also you have a charging for USB, which is very nice. Because again, you can use this as an actual, like in an office or like your desk setup to have your computer up here. And it can be really good for that. I can see that really coming in handy because I was kind of debating on doing that actually. Editing got to get some monotonous, so you need a little bit of something going on <laughs> where you're not just going to fall asleep after a while. So being able to stand could really come in handy. But yeah, again, look at all this room. Like this is a Yu-Gi-Oh play mat, a standard play mat right here, the new Black Rose one that I just received. So you guys can tell, look at all this room that I have right here. So that's just a little bit of room. You could actually have... Uh, several people dueling at this table, which I think is really cool. You know, like four people pretty easily. You could probably even have like a game night up to six people, maybe even a little bit more than that. Just depends how close you guys are and everything and, <laughs> and how much room you want to have. Maybe you want to have more room between you. You could fit probably about four people at the easiest. I would still say about six. So if you want to do something like D&D &D or some other like games, this could easily be for that. You could also like a like I said, just change this up and down. And for like D&D, &D, I was thinking, which I've only played like a couple of games ever of D&D, &D, but if you were like getting like into some kind of like action thing where something's really going on, the DM could like control it where all of a sudden the table's getting really tall. You know, maybe there's something going on there, like some kind of earthquake thing, or you could have it go lower for everyone too. And I can see this actually being really good for children as well because, you know, if you need some room, there you go, you can make it like, look how short this is getting. Like seriously, it keeps going there. I think I'm at the, yeah, I think I'm at the shortest height right there. You have all this room and it's that tall. Yeah, that would easily make it for like younger kids to be able to get to this. And of course, if you don't want them near it too, hey, you work from home with all this stuff going on, have like some really cool stuff you're painting on or cards or whatever, and you don't want your kid to mess with it. Hey, I'm just saying this could come in handy actually. And again, I feel like I'm shrinking, <laughs> but, but look at that. There you go. Look how high this thing's going. That is the max height. So again, I, I feel like I am shrinking. I'm trying to stay on camera for you guys. But yeah, this actually feels really good to me at this max height. You can't see my face anymore, but yeah, it works really well. So I can't recommend this enough. This is a very nice table. This is one I plan to use, like I said, for filming. But again, I could come up with multiple reasons on how to use this because again, like setting up for like a game night or for your like your just your office and stuff, I think that would be really cool as well. So. I really like this desk and I plan to use it for everything. Again, the only downside, if there is one, is that it's heavy. Get a friend to help you assemble it and uh, at least lift it. Because those motors, there's two motors in here, which is good. You know it's going to definitely be able to hold weight and everything, but whew, <laughs> those things are very heavy. So that's the only, like, if, like I said, if that is a negative, that that's the only thing. And also, too, since this is a bamboo top, this is actually environmentally friendly. 
It uh, does not have any odor. It's safe for the environment, everything too. It's not easy to crack or easy wear or anything. It's waterproof. And then even on the legs and everything too, everything has like rounded corners. So there's nothing like sharp. There's nothing you can easily run into unless you're just really trying to, you know, you could stub your toe, but you'd have to really try. And like everything you need is on here. Like seriously, I still want to try this out for like a game night. I think I just gave myself an idea on something I want to do as I'm recording this. So seriously, it's a great table. Uh, it's actually pretty thick too. You can probably tell through the other camera and it just is it's something I'm definitely going to keep forever. <laughs> so, yeah. Tell me what you guys think. Of course, link will be down in the description if you want to get your own. I can't recommend them enough. There are a variety of different sizes. Let me know what you guys think. As always, thank you guys for watching. Be sure to check them out. Link in the description, like I said. And uh, as soon as we get everything where it needs to be, you guys know I will definitely have an update video for you guys. So, thank you for watching. Like and subscribe. And, of course, I will catch you guys later. See ya.